Good evening, friends. I represent the pride of India, Swadesh. Swadesh is an ode to our artists and artisans. It is an initiative to give respect and sustenance to all our handicrafts, men and women. In 2015, I went to Natwara, the temple town of Rajasthan. They follow the age-old practice of painting pitchwise. It was heartbreaking to see that given up their art, their legacy, and taken up jobs as sewage cleaners and bricklayers. That's where the seeds of Swadesh were sown. It is an initiative to give respect to our arts and artisans who have practiced this art for generations and generations. They have learned this art at the feet of the grandfather. Usually this art is passed down from father to son or grandfather to grandson. But I'm happy to see that now my girls are breaking the stereotype. Today, we have with us two young girl artisans of India. They are Garima and Gayatri. <laughs> Garima is a master's at international business management. Yet, she chose to follow her father and gra grandfather's legacy, and now is a blue pottery artist. <laughs> Gayatri is a petani weaver. She is a graduate in business management, but she chose to again follow the legacy of her grandparents and parents, and is now a wonderful and talented Paitani weaver. More power to you girls. When I opened NMACC, I had said that we will take the best of India to the world and bring the world to India. I'm happy to say that on the 9th of November, we are opening our stand-alone Swadesh store, 20,000 square feet, giving respect and sustenance to all our arts and artisans. And that's not all. We plan to take Swadesh globally to New York and to Europe. They truly are the pride of our nation. So let's give a big round of applause to all the arts and artisans of our country. And now, I would like to invite on stage, as a proud mother, my very multi-talented daughter, who is a young mother herself, Isha Ambani Piramal. Can I have you on stage? Thank you, sorry. 